like that. He's like a medic hippo, a rescue hippo, an avenger hippo. That's how I would draw it too. <laughs> I like that picture, man. It's very wholesome. It's very cute. Hello, Jody. I've been thinking about this playthrough, just playing this game and this suggestion for a while now because it's been so long since you've... Not only has it been so long since you've requested this game and saying that it would mean a lot to you, mean the world to you, but also just the very nature of this game. My hope is that... My hope is that after all this time you just got bored of this channel and you're completely fine and you just went on with your life and did your own thing whether you went on to another or started watching another creator or had fun another way i would love that that would be that would be great go go live your life however um whatever else the case may be i there's no way for me to know i hope you're okay and i'm finally here and also welcome back i'm here in 4k me and my blemish are here in 4k i was gone for a while because i was i was pretty much making a new setup uh, for content creation and i'm gonna make a video on that too and you are jody you are the first person to get the 4k treatment uh at least on the on the camera side on the personal camera side the actual gameplay will be in 1440p we've upgraded that as well that and just finally getting to your suggestion is the most I could give to you. I hope that, you know, if you're still around, that this is a, a pretty good gift for you this holiday season. And, you know, if if you're not watching my channel anymore, then obviously you wouldn't be hearing this. But it's not just you, I'm sure, who would appreciate this playthrough and the suggestion. So I'm sure there's a lot more to say. Uh, I didn't really write a script or anything. I just went ahead and finally decided to start getting through these suggestions just uh what what better time to start doing that again than than the holiday season all right today is a great day for madness if you are new here welcome to the greatest entertainment in the galaxy i am architect if you're not new hello friends it is good to have you back that dragon cancer i was hoping that it wasn't actually about cancer but it is an immersive narrative video game that retells joel green's four-year fight against cancer through about two hours of poetic imaginative gameplay that explores themes of faith hope and love this came out in 2016 i believe i saw some thumbnails of jack and markiplier but they they made videos about this so it's a pretty uh it was a pretty big deal, and I'm honored that someone even requested for me to play it. If all else fails, if you don't see this, Jody, I will tag you somewhere if that works uh, somehow. But this is this is what I got for you. Let's just get on. Let's just get to it. <sighs> if you have a cup of tea or any tea anywhere, I have some tea right now to to relax. My eyes have been uh, have been hurting a little bit today. So I wear some, uh, wore some, some gun R's. <laughs> Not sponsored at all. We're less than 3k subs, so I don't think that would happen. Options. Let's see. Let's see if we can, the best graphical fidelity that I could give to you guys. Fast good. Fantastic. I feel like beautiful, beautiful is much better than fantastic. Uh, unpopular opinion. This new game, I guess. Wow, finally getting to it. Turn it down a little bit. Look around. 
I'm the duck. So remember everyone, this is... It's supposed to be imaginative and poetic. Uh huh. Is that Joel? Is that a kiddo? Oh! You can speak! Make noises. Yeah, let me eat that. Thank you. Thank you, Joel. Those are big pieces of bread. I could choke on that. I'm surprised I could eat it. Oh, damn. You're feeding me a bunch. I'm grateful. Get the bread. You've eaten a lot of bread by now. <laughs> this duck. Guys, give. <laughs> as he, as he, he, does the... pieces, he doesn't understand. Here you go, Joel. Here's a piece. Okay, no, you throw. Yeah, you threw. Five wipe. You've been throwing big pieces yeah. this whole time. What? <laughs> but, he, but he can't talk. It's true. Mm. You always can talk. Yeah, no. Why can't Joel? <laughs> well. Joel got sick right after he turned one and, um... Kinda slowed him down a little bit, buddy. Yeah. Oh, man. See, he's just slower than most kids. I think eventually he'll catch up. You think Joel will read? Yeah, I think Joel will read eventually. Mm -hmm. well, of course, he's just the way because, you know. Yeah. Um, Joel's supposed to be a boy, but he's a baby. <laughs> he's a boy baby. Oh. <laughs> yep, he's a You're boy You're either baby. a boy or a baby. <laughs> you know, there's lots of things Joel isn't good at, but there's some things he is good at. What is he good at? He's <coughs> eating, laughing. <laughs> Me too. Yeah. I'm good at making him laugh. You are good at making him laugh. Why do you, how do you make him laugh? I fall down. Yeah. <laughs> it's really funny when you fall down. <laughs> what what happened to the duck? <laughs> the duck kind of just <laughs> where do you go <laughs> park at the edge of the world it's really cozy very wholesome so far in cups bathtubs Wow, wow. And the warm, wet tongues and the cool fur of Das. And this, maybe this week, was a daily affection. And bye bye. And blown kisses. And more. Mm. Oh, always more. This full list of words. <laughs> so few. So, I'm used to WASD, I guess you don't use that, you just click, point and click. He went, kind of went off the beaten path here. Time is the way we perceive time is very fickle. Depends on what you're doing and circumstances and no one really has a good grasp on time. There's no it's not a it's not a black and white thing.
I'm gonna go around here. Oh, this tree is not rendered in. Or it's just all black. So I'm assuming the people speaking are the father and the mother of this child? I mean, that's, that's what I'm gathering from this. I don't think we missed anything down there, do we? I mean, we, we already were throwing the bread around. In the water for the duck. Is pain without a word for it. What is hope without a word for it? Who is God? What is joy? A lot of these questions we've been asking for a very, very long time as a collective species, right? Trying to figure it out. And we don't even know if that's even the right question. There's another one of those uh, unrendered plants, or black plants, an abandoned rowboat. I wonder if I'm overthinking it and that's just an asset, or if uh, that actually plays a bigger part in the story. Ah! There they are, there's the family. Let's come join them. Who am I to him? <laughs> Dada. Mm hmm. <laughs> I'm sure that's enough, right? He comprehends you as some. He, he finds some comfort with you, whether you're Dada or. Some other shit, I mean, it doesn't matter. He perceives you, and, uh, and loves you. I'm sure he does. Ready? Oh. We're tapping. Are you ready? Oh, I fucked it up. <laughs> ready? Go. There we go. Can't believe I fucked that up. <laughs> okay, Joel. Ready? Damn, we don't really have playgrounds anymore, do we? And if we do, do kids still go on go. playgrounds? They don't like. What do, what do, uh, what do kids do nowadays? They kind of. This is go on TikTok and Fortnite, right? <laughs> I I'm old, so that's what I think they do. Alright, let's push him one more time. <laughs> Alright. Okay, Joel, ready? I never really played on these on these things. When I was a kid. Let's see, what did I play on? Not that. I liked this. This little jungle gym thing here. I liked the monkey bars. Who's that? Let's tell him, Caleb, that Joel's doing really well. Doing really well? Yeah. He's been very peaceful all afternoon. Good. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Are these real? 
I've been wondering this since the beginning if these were real audio recordings. Who's that? Hmm? Let's tell them Caleb that Joel's doing really well. Joel's doing really well? Yeah. <laughs> Ready? He's been very peaceful all afternoon. Yeah, he's doing Sounds well. Good. Come uh, down. Go. He's quite the risk taker for a, a kid that kind of got sick, you know? Is it my turn? It is my turn to go down the slide. Yeah, man. I've always been a risk taker. Oh, we were taking turns. I want to make sure that we're not missing subtitles. I think we're good. I want to make sure everyone is included here. Yeah, why don't you go one more time? Who's that? Let's tell him, Caleb, that Joel's doing really well. Joel's doing really well? Yeah. Who's that? Alright. Let's tell him, Caleb, that So that's Joel's doing done. Really well. Why don't we push him on the, the swing? I also liked the swings. Do I have to keep pressing or he's, he's just gonna... Oh, okay. Yeah! Look at Joel! <laughs> I mean, the way they're portraying Joel, he seems pretty brave. He was only two years old. And he's he was already, like, not really freaking out doing all these things. Damn. So I guess that's... It's the swing. Oh, check your phone. Amy. Hey babe, just got 11, to the 11. Um, now they think that maybe he's throwing up all the time because he has acid reflux. So they gave me a medication and we can give it to Joel. And they mm. said we have to give it at least three full days. But that if he's still throwing up after that, that we can come back. And I mentioned the head tilt thing again, even though they keep saying it's not related. But you always have to mention that one weird outlying thing. So I told them how his head was tilted to the right, but they still say that that's uh -huh. probably not related at all. So I guess we'll just give this a try. I don't know, man. I don't know. I'll tell you more about it when you get home. Yeah, from what I've seen, uh, not really my experience, because I'm, I'm not a parent. But from what I've seen from other parents, is usually their their gut feeling is usually right, or they're at least on to something. So I kind of I kind of don't like when doctors kind of just brush things off. If I were a parent and I thought something were wrong with my child and there's like this outlier kind of weird thing going on with them, I would keep pressing them about it cuz I feel like I feel like parents are good at noticing off things about their children cuz they're with their child all the time, right? Also, is no one playing with this kid? He needs friends. Or maybe, I don't know, maybe kids don't go out to the park like that anymore. Damn. Those are some tall... What is that, a redwood tree? <laughs> NorCal with redwood trees? Oh, I was on here the whole time. That's pretty nice to look at. I'm finishing up my tea here and I uh, I also brewed some, some coffee. I'm just a caffeine addict. I love my caffeine. I didn't sleep too well last night, so... I will be having the coffee after the tea. Because the coffee, or the tea rather, is relaxing. And then the, the coffee will be stimulating. Say hi. 
you have a drink, you have a warm, warm drink or anything. There we go. You have a warm drink or anything. Uh, just checking to see. Uh, if you see me looking up here, that's this is the monitor where I see my recording session. You have a coffee or a tea or anything? Get some for yourself. This is quite. This is gonna be quite a a cozy video. Very very cozy video. <sighs> I ground up a uh, a holiday blend. Holiday blend uh, coffee beans in my French press here. Uh, while this video will be edited, I don't think I'm gonna edit this video all that much. Uh, I don't think it's that type of... I don't think it's that type of game or video, and it doesn't need to be. It's probably gonna be a longer one too. It doesn't need to be shorter. He seems a bit down, actually. I think... I don't know how to cheer him up. I mean, let's see. Let's see if we push, we push this thing around ourselves a bit more. If he'll cheer up. We push. Oh, he left. Oh no, the. Damn, I kind of didn't like that. The wind seemed to have just taken him away. Will he like it here? I don't know, he seems... There's no telling because he doesn't have a face. <laughs> oh, he's giggling. There you go. <laughs> maybe he wants to go even higher. Maybe... Maybe he uh, needs more stimulation. <laughs> Can we talk to the dad? I'm assuming that's a dad. I wanna have a word with him. Your papa, or sorry, dada. Your dada. Nope, can't talk to him. Guess we're crossing the bridge. Okay. Let's go. Yeah, there's more of that shit there. Yeah, I knew that was going to be part of the game. He's on a stretcher. Okay. I don't like how that looks. saying much by the way I'm just I don't think there is much to say during these moments uh, I just become very observant I don't really like speaking unless I really have something to say or if I should speak at fear all fear is cancer's preservative cancer's embalming oil and you O oh accuser are fear's oil sales a snake, a serpent, a dragon with snuffed out coal on his breath, molting, talons broken from the struggle to free yourself of your own skin. That was the introduction. Huh. 
Huh. I'm assuming this is the hospital. It's either an apartment complex or a hospital. On hospital time. Ah, there we go. He's with his uh, baby. Hey, do you want a rock? You need a rocking chair. Is that a rocking chair? Okay, let's rock. There we go. Kind of. Oh, I see. Kind of move him back and forth. Very quiet. Now I'm Dada. Hey, babe. I was just thinking, do you ever think maybe Joel can hear better than he's supposed to be able to? Because I know, like, it's supposed to be moderate to severe hearing loss, but sometimes, like today, he hears music playing before I do. So I saw him dancing, huh. and I had to look around to hear that a song was playing. And I just don't, like, if his hearing loss is that bad, I can't imagine. I don't know. I just wonder about it. Anyway, call me Keeps later. going in and I out. <laughs> His hearing loss keeps... Maybe you have hearing loss. <laughs> what is that? Um... That doesn't sound good. I feel like you should be asking for help here. did. Alright. It's night time. There we go. Is this when he's a newborn? Or did they just take him to the hospital? What is that? Oh, those are the gloves. Like, the doctor's gloves. I used to do that all the time. It'll blow them up and they, they look kind of funny. Oh, they're all- Oh, there's a lot of them. Hey, that's a lot. That's a little too much, man. You just need, like, one or two, maybe. Maximum. You don't need all this. It's gonna wake the baby! It's gonna land on the baby! Stop! <laughs> you, we need to stop this. What the hell? Why was it... Oh, okay. He was falling asleep. Where are you going, Joel? Get down here! Oh, I see, I see. I have to guide him. How do I make him avoid... ...all of this? Oh, okay, okay. Sorry, I'm a bit slow today. Been pretty tired. Reason why I've been missing all the suggestions is because I've been... I haven't been doing nothing. Um... You can see the mess in the background that I failed to address earlier, but there is a mess in the background. And uh, that is from the holiday season. And me preparing. Ooh, a bit in between. 
Uh, me preparing uh, the new setup for what we have going on here right now. Oh man, that that angle is weird. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, there's so many! Am I- I'm beginning to think I wasn't supposed to... to get through this. Oh, I see. But Joel's in the crib now. Hi, Joel. I had a bad dream about you. Oh, hey. Um, I just wanted to take a shower. Is that okay? Are you okay with Joel? Okay, thanks. Mm hmm. Go ahead, man. Must be uh, tiring being a papa. Oh, doggy. And we got service doggy here. Hi, doggy. We pet the dog. Oh, we gotta listen to his heart. Is that his heart? What is that? What is that? What are we listening to? Oh, there's different... Okay. <laughs> Have they had this dog for a while? Too much. He ended up coughing. Peanut butter. Easy. Easy. Hey, easy, Axel. <laughs> Isn't that funny? Isn't that goofy? <laughs> yeah. He snatches it out of your hand. And yeah, yeah. That's just on his or near his stomach now. Are these parts of the dog that Joel liked to lay on when he was a baby? That's just my guess. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, I'm assuming these parts that have the audio logs on them are parts of the dog that Joel likes to lay on. Maybe. It, it just seems like that. Which is a very creative way to, uh... It's, that's just very creative. Oh, you know what? My mouse keeps heading out into my next monitor. He has the service dog, um, apparel. What do they call that? He's, he's labeled as a service dog, I think. Is that all? Hey, buddy. Oh. Wait, was that it? Do I have to? Oh, okay. That was it. Okay. Doctor. I believe it's doctor. <sighs> End of treatment party. Oh, are those real photos? One second, I may have the night light on, because it's very orange. Yeah, those look like real photos. Let's check them out. Brittany. Hello, Brittany. There we go. Um... Oh no... I think that says in, in loving memory... Brittany Beckman... Fuck... It kinda looks like... It kind of looks like they, uh, they passed away close to their birthday. Colors of Valor. Hmm. It's wholesome. Desin... Des... Desin... Cap... Capusin? Cape... <laughs> Sorry, I had... I'm as American as you can get, so I ain't no damn no lit no how to read that. So, uh, whoever drew this, if this is how they perceived it themselves, man, they're pretty positive. I like that. And it was said that fear. Uh, I don't remember exactly what it was, but fear kind of fueled the cancer. Family in Color by Carolyn. Caroline? Carolyn. Family in Color. Hey, that's a pretty good picture. I like the rainbow at the top. And how it kind of clips over here. See, that takes a lot of artistic vision. To have that spatial awareness. To still connect it. Unusual Gravity by Hadriel. Shit, man. Hadriel got a lot of... It's... There's like water driplets up top. Hold on. No, 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 I wasn't done looking at that. Yeah, see, it's kind of like 
Looks like it's melting. Starlight Hippo. <laughs> this is some shit I would draw. I like this one. <laughs> Hey, I like that. He's like a medic hippo, a rescue hippo, an avenger hippo. That's how I would draw it too. <laughs> I like that picture, man. It's very wholesome. It's very cute. It's very, uh, it's pretty funny too. <laughs> oh man. I can't get over those real pictures. That's a... That's a tough time, huh? There's more. Oh man. I actually really like looking at these. Journey in Light and Darkness by Sylvia Walgren. Huh. Wow. This one's... This one is pretty incredible. I really like this one. Holy shit. And no, no, look at the shirt too. The shirt reflects it, the heart in there. Yeah, man, you can't be all light. There's no light without darkness and there's no darkness without light. Dance like no one's watching. <laughs> My man. Dance like no one's watching. You're not really dancing right now, though, but I... I agree. <laughs> Offspring by Chris Abbey. I like that. Is that a photo? I like that photo. I have a thing for a very crisp... Um, minimalist not less minimalist more clean visuals i like that what else do we have here still life still life like we're standing still martin walgren oh you're related to that other person the other the artist of the other picture. Because it's, it's untouched? Still life? Interesting, interesting. Oh my god, we have so much more artwork. Why don't we make our rounds? Let's go around here. We gotta see what's in the back over there too. Daleen. Daleen Yellow Kayak. <laughs> That's very happy. That's cool. I'm scared of sharks though. Even though sharks don't really kill that many people per year. Untitled. Ugh. <sighs> Falling slowly. That's a beautiful picture. Man, I just want to say for the record... <clears throat> I don't just stick to one type of playthrough. I know I've kind of, over time, have been building this brand. Where it's just... Really... Not really dark humor, but there's dark humor because of South Park, I guess. And it's... I, I do like... I like violent games. I like action games, adventure. But I, I like games in general, but more than that, I do appreciate, I appreciate digital media and art forms in general. So I didn't expect to be, it's, it's not hit in the fields. It's not that shit. It's, I, I didn't expect to be 
sort of moved, I guess, just from looking at pictures and the, the slight ambient music in the background and the real art that I'm seeing, I'm assuming. Uh, I like it. I'm enjoying it. Thank you, Jeff Moore. This entitled one is very... <sighs> mm. Hope I'm not missing anything. Jeff Stockhausen. <laughs> I'm assuming that's Papa. That's Papa and Baby. Little baby Foopy. There's a Foopy right there. more here race away cancer <clears throat> oh man look at all those signatures and names <laughs> J Taylor fudge Any more stuff back here? I want to see if I can make my rounds. Man, there's much, much more. Damn, man, the fucking monitor. You, you're fucking up my- Roar Over Me by Eric Hom Homeland. I love you. I am the perfect father. I give you joy. You are fearfully and wonderfully made. Damn. Is this a Bible verse? Or is this part of a Bible verse? Because down there, interestingly enough, is my real name. And I believe that's chapter 3, verse 8 in the Bible. I myself am not very religious, but I have grown up around religion. And I think I recognize that as a Bible verse, which is pretty interesting. I will give you the desires of your heart. I know everything about you. You are my treasure. You are not a mistake. I chose you. If you seek me, you will find. You will find me. Hope. I give you peace. I will wipe away your tears. I am not angry at you. I rejoice over you. You are mine. You are my offspring. I am close to you. My desire is to lavish my love. You are my beloved. I want to show you great great things oh my desire is to lavish my love for you I will take away your pain I am your provider I will never leave you and then we got we got some people rejoicing it's interesting because I kind of renounced- I used to be very, very religious growing up. Which I'm revealing some lore about myself. I used to be very religious growing up. And I kind of renounced religion in a very angry way. And... I don't know. After so many years, I realized religion gives people... It gives people a good set of... They're not really rules. Uh, values to live by and it gives an increased likelihood in a peaceful life so I see I do see the purpose in it ramparts deferred sick by satchel drakes that's sick man Connor man Connor's sleeping leave him alone <laughs> Bernie and Aiden hello 
That's a real cute picture. August. Hmm. Kind of like in the art style of the game. Untitled by Sean Heron. That's happy, man. Can't beat that. Can't beat happiness like that. By Rebecca Meyer. Rebecca M. <laughs> they like separated her name with the body. That's sick. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, they kind of got like a, a certain art concept down at a really young age. This is some shit I would draw right now. <laughs> so good, good for you, Rebecca. M Ma Malet, Malet, Mariella Noella. Damn, I'm butchering your name. I'm sorry. I'm assuming that's you, in... <sighs> I appreciate that positivity. By Stefan. Stefan Shellard. Oh, a little, uh, a little contrast here. Just pure blacks. I'm not too artistic to, uh, I'm not artistic enough to really know everything that I should know about art pieces. <laughs> Phoenix, The Beginning of the End, by Digby Davidson, 1997. Man, I was born that year. And I'm, and I'm still here. Damn, dude. But, but, drawing, not drawing, making of Phoenix, The Beginning of the End. You're fucking sick, man. <laughs> By Lily Annabella. I need a break. Fuck. Lily. The other ear is not finished. <laughs> That's a that's a foopy. That's a foopy if I've ever seen one. That's a baby. <clears throat> you didn't finish the ear. You've come full circle. And there's still a bit more to see. I think there is a painting. Oh whoa! Oh whoa! You're taking me too far. <laughs> what was that? There is one right there. There we go, let's see that first. Nehemiah 810 by Sarah Reinwald. That's a Bible verse. And it looks like it's their interpretation of the Bible verse. I'm actually very curious. It's a wood texture with an X pattern. This is the new international version. Nehemiah said, go and enjoy choice food and sweet drinks and send some to those who have nothing prepared. This day is holy to our Lord. Do not grieve for the joy of the Lord is your strength. And I wish I wish I knew more about art because it's a very hopeful uh, Bible verse, and I'm glad they had something to uh, to hold on to. I'm gonna go ahead and reset, not the gameplay, the recording, because I got some new storage, 
And jo Jody, this is like, you are the first to experience the new setup. Um, I, I, I'm kind of just going at it right now because I just wanted to get it started, but I will resume the recording in a bit. One second.